all right hello everyone welcome uh, so in this video we're going to make something different and we will make this gallery and as you can see we have uh, this uh, simple app we have the three images and we can swap uh, to this by sliding from left uh, to right or uh, right to left uh, so we will customize uh, these images and i you i have used uh, some default images and uh, now let's uh, get started uh, by making this app so first we will uh, create a new file and we will name uh, i will name this file to be third.py uh, then uh, we will start from uh, first we will import the library which is kv and uh, kv.require uh, the minimum version which will be 1.2.0 uh, then after that we will from uh, kv dot uh, app we will import the main app as like this and we must import this uh, app uh, to run uh, your file without this is uh, maybe obligatory for your uh, run of the file and if you uh, didn't import this uh, statement you will not run your file anymore and after that we will uh, try to import we uh, will uh, and uh, we use some uh, widgets uh, so i will import the uh, main widget which is here and uh, make sure you type this uh, w to be uh, uh, capital and this will be capital and as you can see all these are small uh, letter cases and after that uh, from the kv.factory uh, we will import the factory uh, capital and after that uh, also from kv we have some errors but let's uh, skip it for now we want all, uh, uh, we uh, want also the carousel so we will import the carousel so we have some error here uh, this is factory after we have imported the, uh, the important library we can uh, go uh, here and make an class so th this class will be any uh, uh, name but make sure you have type capital first and maybe uh, my first window like this and uh, it will um, uh, inherit from widget but i don't want to inherit from widget uh, i want to uh, get the box layout so from make sure you have typed it correctly from uh, kv.uix.carousel we uh, want the not the carousel the box layout so uh, from the box layout we uh, want to import import box layout Alright, uh, then we will in inherit from the box layout and after that we will define that we have some initialization and this is the constructor. So define init and uh, first argument is self and second argument is some uh, keywords and this is the constructor. So uh, super if we if any in child will inherit from this my first window we will uh, initialize it uh, to uh, get some uh, keywords also so this is our constructor and after that we have missed here the, uh, this character and after that we want uh, we have some carousel so we will define that we have a carousel and this uh, carousel let's go back and this carousel will have the direction to be the right and after that we have for i in range of three we will import uh, something we will say that we have a source image uh, defined in uh, image and this will be an integer dot jpeg and uh, we will use uh, here the eye so uh, we have image one image two image three image four image five and after that we have the image itself so we have defined the source but we have the image which is a sync a sync image so why we have used a sync image so a sync image is uh, actually uh, uh, used also from kv dot uix dot async image you can import the async image you can import from the factory and you can import from the uix and after that we will import this image and we have the source 
to be src and we have allow stretch to be to be true uh, so uh, after that we can add the carousel we can add the image to the carousel simply by adding using the add widget function and we will add the image after that after three uh, times we have three images only if you have more you can define this number if you have around 20 image you can uh, adjust it to be 20 like this and make sure that this i starts from zero not one so uh, make sure that we ha you have typed it correctly and after that af after we have added the three images so uh, after that we can go to self dot add widget so this box layout will contain the carousel like this carousel and again make sure that you have the self like this all right uh, after that uh, we can uh, go and start our uh, the app so uh, we will say class third app inherited from app define we will override the build function define build of self return return this my first window and after that if we want to run our file so if name have the same name of the function we will uh, say third app dot run all right let's go back and save our file we have everything uh, correctly i will go back here and uh, close this old one and say python 3 and uh, we have the name which is third dot by let's uh, run this file so we have something error here so uh, we have uh, this so let's go back and rerun and uh, it say that so make sure that you have type one uh, semicolon like this and one quotes like this again we uh, can go back and try to run our file and it say that the super has no attribute my first window i think also we have some errors in the here so did dot in yet like this anyway uh, let's rerun our app and uh, it has image one to, to the right so uh, we have defined here the direction to be the right uh, and again uh, we can uh, swap to the right or to the left and we have only three images and uh, let's this is the right dimensions and as you can see we have make it correctly so in the next uh, video we will see how we can use the uh, dot key v language to in make this in instead of using the these functions or uh, we will use some uh, kv uh, file so let's uh, go uh, start from the first lesson